Hi guys, so I did a thing in my little overboard today, but to be fair, I had to go buy friends birthday presents, and we have three birthdays coming up this weekend for Japan Fest, and it's a doll meet, and so, uh, I'm not done shopping, but this is part of it, and I swear to God, if the two of the three recipients see this video, I'm gonna kick your butt. <laughs> Because <laughs> I, I want to show this stuff off before they even get to see it. So, Will, like, Will told me, he's like, if you're going shopping, can you, um, buy me surprises? I'm like, okay. So, I got him, oh, by the way, the first, I can't believe I didn't, okay, the first batch of stuff is from Five Below. The second batch of stuff is Dollar Tree. The third batch of stuff is Goodwill. So yeah, I went, a lot of, I went to a lot of places today. Also, there's one set uh, from Spirit Halloween. And, and it was only $2, so that's the only reason why I got it. <laughs> okay, so there's this Overwatch lanyard. And Will Mains Diva. And Junkrat. But I figured this would be really cute for his work or whatever. So that would be really cute. And then I got him this Joker beanie. Which flips over. Which, at the five below, was like this. Sorry for the, the shadow. Okay, they had a lot of mermaid stuff. And, I mean, a lot of mermaid stuff. Other five belows, I've seen people have, like, lots of unicorn stuff. But, for some reason, ours had lots of mermaid stuff. I'm not complaining. Okay, so, yeah, you see the box? I got a Posy Reef, daughter of Poseidon. I've never had her before. She glows in the dark. Like her little seahorses and stuff, glow in the dark. And her tentacles are poseable, and I think it's so cool. Next thing was awesome is this rainbow highlighter. And I've been wanting one of these for a while. And I think it's super cute. And it's big too, like, it's huge, like, compared to the Rainbow Dash one that's like not even like a quarter size of the. Uh, of this one at Claire's and that one's like ten dollars. This is four. Four dollars. And that's gonna last a really long time. Uh the next thing is and sorry you see my foot. I'm just really, really tired today after shopping. So this is a mermaid crown. These are actually plastic crystals, which is a little bit better for me because I stabbed myself a lot by accident. And there is wire. And that's one reason why I was like, they better not be watching this video because I each got them one because I thought it was very Sailor Moon esque. And so I got those. And then I got mermaid tail blankets. These were $5. But there's going to be something else thrown in with it to make it even prettier. I was looking for galaxy stuff. And if I blow stuff, selling galaxy things. And I was like, no, they love galaxy things. Crap. Or, or Miku stuff, and they they stopped selling Miku stuff. I'm like, no, but it's so pretty. And I wanted them to have them. So the last thing I got was something I actually freaked out about because I really, really, really love My Little Pony. If you don't know this, I mean, like, look. My castle, and my G1s, and G2s, and my, my G4s. I was not going to get any more G4s. I think I'm done with the with the G4s unless I find some rare ones. But I got some G1 knee socks and they are gorgeous. And yes, I'm going to be wearing these. I'm actually going to be wearing these to Japan Japan Fest Sunday. So those and then probably my rainbow highlighter going to be in Decora. Yep, there goes one of my crystals. Off mine. Because it's already fallen off. I got to glue mine down. Theirs are actually very stable. Okay, so the next thing I have to twist over. I'm sorry. I have to twist around. So this is the Dollar Tree haul. Right now, Dollar Tree has these. And these are actually $5 at Walmart, by the way. Uh, some of them are die cast. Yeah, like this one's die cast. This one's die cast. Star Wars ships. I am big on Star Wars. The TIE Fighter. And Sith Infiltrator. And they're really cool. Okay. So the next thing I got were two of these, like, Baroque-style frame, like, skull mirrors for the den. 
because I'm doing like a gothic den and also Halloween decorations. Hello. This guy I'm going to paint up and make a little bit more creepy because it looks kind of cheap, but not very much. Uh, got two creepy cloths. I actually got a pack of those battery operated, like, uh, fairy lights. But the cashier gave me a ripped bag. And apparently, I lost those in the parking lot. And I'm too tired to go back. And I'll probably just, I guess I'll just buy some next time I go. But one was going to be a DIY with the lights. And then one's from a, the mantle. And I got this to wear with the pony socks and stuff. Because Decor and Fairy K wear rosettes. And Dollar Tree has these and they're cute. So, getting those. The nail section and the makeup section, this made me very, very happy. This is like a wheel of polymer clay canes and it had all the different fruits and stuff so I thought that was cool and I've been looking for this for a while and I couldn't find this in time for my birthday but we have doll meats I run BJD's of Memphis so we do lots of meetups at least one to two meetups a month and it requires lots of snacks so I've been wanting something like this or to make a fancy one out of candlesticks and fancy plates and stuff, but I haven't had the time. So I just got this for a dollar just to test it out, see how it works. It's worth a try, right? Okay, so the next thing is I do I opened a lot of this stuff and I feel bad now. But I was really excited when I got home. This is gonna need a lot of ironing, but this is a whole like pinup costume like set. And apparently your spirit Halloween does have a little clearance section if you ask or you check and this was two dollars and I thought hey this would make an adorable Monster High Operetta cosplay this would make a great pinup Harley Quinn cosplay or just costume and I've been wanting to do that for a while anyway so for two dollars I'll take it because they're really cute so I mean two dollars not bad at all okay get prepared because you guys know, as of recent, I've been finding a lot of vintage plushies. And me and Raven found a lot of vintage plushies. Today. Just as much as two weeks ago. Whoever's donating them, just keep doing it. I'm not complaining. Okay. First one was found in the front of Goodwill. Miko. I love Pocahontas. I love a lot of the Disney princesses, honestly. But I, I wish it was the big one I used to have with the like the biscuit cookie but I do uh, he's really cool Raven got him for me and then I found this guy I finally have another popple I've got my my big orange popple up here but this little white popple is super pretty and still has the tail and is pretty clean I'm still gonna clean him up but he's pretty clean and I'm not like very very cute okay so the next thing is a lots of legs. I actually bought this in front of the Goodwill. I paid two dollars for this. Oh crap! I also found a, a Funko Pop in the box. I found a Baby Groot, and I paid two dollars for it. And it's for Will. But I found the lots of legs at the same time. I found the Baby Groot. It was lots of lots of legs. I paid two dollars for them. But I've never had one of these before. <laughs> they look like Rainbow Bright characters. And they made me happy. And I've never had one of these. And I've seen lots of people in the vintage toy groups have them. And it's pretty cute. So I'm going to keep it. And then speaking of Rainbow Bright. I got this Sprite. Like the little pillow plushie. And I used to have some Care Bear ones. I don't have any anymore. We actually put a Care Bear cousin up. It was the Cozy Heart Penguin. Because I already have him. But the one I put back was in better shape. The face was just a little flat. But it's still really cute. Okay. So, next thing is like the Valentine's Day puff lump bunny, I think it is. Either way, it's a puff lump bunny, and it's really, really fluffy and cute. i uh, probably keeping this one as well, because it's cute, and I, I love, I love puff lumps. Okay, this one, I don't know, I'll have to do my research, because I've never seen this before. But it's got like a little, like palm tree, but it's fading out right here. But it's so cute, and it's puffle up, like, that vinyl material. It's got a tag on it, but I've, 
never seen this before and I really really like it and it's not the boy equivalent of puff lumps because I have those and they have like a little sound in them that makes weird like squeaky noises and then the next thing I found was a wuzzle and he's the one that's the rabbit hippo and then he's got wings and both me and Raven love him so we're kind of sharing custody of him at least till we find another one he is so cute and adorable and I love him and before I get to the last plushie, let's just get into this little stuff. Because I'm like, basically almost done. I found this Justice Keychain. I found this to go with the Halloween decor too. It's really cute. I found a party animal. I haven't seen one of these in a good while. This is the one that it's the best friend heart. So they click together, but I only found the one. And party animals are these little bears. They're plastic and then they come in a rubber suit. They are by Moose Toys. And they were cute, but they, they're discontinued, and I'm sad about that. This is really cute, and it should fit my really, really tiny wrist. This is a gorgeous old-school metal Snow White bracelet. I was hoping it was a necklace, but it's not. But it's really, really cute, and I like it. <laughs> it's really heavy. Uh, I thought this was a Moonbeams or something, but it's, it's not because they're animals, and this is a little girl. But I think this is vintage because this was in a bin of just random things. It's just really cute. And then I found this. It is a very sad little stitch and I think it goes on a lanyard. It's so cute. And I'm going to cover up the boobs but I found a Disney store Ariel that has got a gorgeous face. Still has the tail. I know I have a bra somewhere. But I've had one of these before and I sold it. And look, I guess I just got it back and then I found this really nice, like, doll jacket, and then I found an American Girl doll, just blue top. I thought it was worth grabbing. This I'm going to have to wash, maybe twice. It is a Monster High Winter headband, really, really thick fleece. But I was like, I love anything Monster High, except for the reboots. You guys already know, I think I've taken down the, the rant video from two years ago, but... We're not going to get into that. I just like classic Monster High. There. Enough said. Okay. The next thing is an entire stack of Animal Crossing Amiibo cards. And I think I know if we have any dupes who I'm sending them to. We have a friend in Australia. Adam, you are getting some of these. I'm going to send you some of these, buddy, because I know you don't have any. Oh, we already have a Tom Nook. He's going to get a Tom Nook, and I know we have a KK Slider. I'm not going to show you all these. A lot of them are shiny, so these are good. Well, there's Red and Timmy. Timmy and... Yeah, these are really good, and there's... Yeah, there's lots of dupes, so you'll be getting lots of dupes. I guess somebody just cleared out their collection, but these are awesome, and these are the older ones, so that's good. Okay. So, this, if you guys from the 90s either remember the nets that had plushies, well, this is one of the hooks. You can just clip the plushies with this, and it just, you can hang it up, and you have your uh, plushies hang, uh, hung up. Okay, so last thing. Do you see the tail? Last thing. This is like a Fluttershy colored, like pastel. Super cute. It's smaller than this one, but I know it probably belonged to the same person. But this was also in the back of Goodwill. This popple has got to be my favorite popple, other than the little coin bag and the little one with the little joke card from last time. I love this one. This is probably just going to be called Fluttershy. She is precious. I love her tail. I love her colors. That is a really cute colorway. I am very happy with all this. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was like 14 minutes long. I honestly, like I said, I don't like I don't mind doing um long videos because I myself enjoy longer videos. Like watching you YouTube videos. I don't like them to be like two or three minutes long because then I have to switch to the next one. And if I'm cleaning and I walk away, I don't want to be like, oh, where did that video go? Mmm. It got lost in the history. Whatever. I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I can't wait to haul some more stuff for you in the future. Till next time, guys. Bye!